The funeral's taken place today of the Royal Navy officer shot dead on a nuclear submarine. Weapons Engineering Officer Lieutenant Commander Ian Molyneux died during an incident on board HMS Astute when it was docked in Southampton three weeks ago. Hundreds of mourners gathered to pay their respects at the Sacred Heart Catholic Church in his hometown of Wigan. From there, Tim Cooper reports. The close-knit community of Wigan was joined by more than 200 sailors and submariners to say a final farewell to Lieutenant Commander Ian Molyneux. The service was to represent the three abiding loves of the Lieutenant Commander, his family, widow Jill, and his four children, the Royal Navy, which he joined in 1990 at the age of 16, and his hometown, Wigan. Lieutenant Commander Molyneux was shot dead aboard HMS Astute almost three weeks ago. The submarine had been on a goodwill visit to Southampton. A.B. Ryan Donovan has been remanded into custody, charged with murder. And so there are people from the Navy from all across the, uh, the service here today. Uh, and I think that's a reflection of the popularity of the guy. He was not only a, 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 a really excellent submarine and a superb professional, but a really popular guy, and that's because he had time for everybody. He took the time and effort to explain some really quite difficult things to everybody in the crew, the most senior and the most junior. Ian Molyneux's coffin was carried into Sacred Cross Catholic Church by Royal Navy personnel. During the service, his family and colleagues spoke in tribute. Now, this gentle giant with the mischievous twinkle in his eye was also a supremely professional weapons engineer and a submariner whose knowledge and technical expertise sped far beyond the boundary of his own department. I will forever hold on to the belief that you will always walk beside me and that I will see you again. Godspeed. Following the service, the streets of Wigan were lined with sailors and townsfolk paying their silent tribute as Lieutenant Commander Ian Molyneux was driven from the church for a private burial. Tim Cooper, Forces News, Wigan.